Sadly the next morning, Ida found the babe missing from the trap outside his house. An old man lay inside covered in bruises. He was thought to be an illegal war crosser that rushed Eat into the house to get a friend to dispose of the body with him, as it is illegal to make traps without permission. At this point, Peter couldn't help but wonder and came to check it out. The old man smells the child's breath and comes back to life. Scared, the father rushed after him, but Peter went straight to the sheriff's car. From him, he learns that the town has been very unsettled lately as if there are ghosts roaming around. Peter's best mate's bag of potatoes was missing. All the heaters in town are gone too. A straw doll was left in his bed after his best mate disappeared. Peter rushed to call the rest of the village. Sure enough, they were all gone. He rushed to tell the adults. At that moment the old man, badly injured, attacked the hunter and almost spit his ear off. The old man wouldn't speak. He only reacted when he saw Ida. The adults believed Peter and tied the old man up.